Well, hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to Life of Wonders. As you know, this is Polo and I love making videos of dolls, toys and Disney collectibles. And as always, if you like this kind of content and you feel like supporting the channel, then you already know what to do. So today we're going to be exploring in detail this Ultimate Series 2 Laguna Blue. Um, and she's just so amazing and as you know i actually cover the unboxing uh, earlier on with my friend jess and so she's already out of the box but i wanted to show you uh what um the um, outside of the locker room this time that has been changed i mean the layout of it in my opinion is so much more beautiful than Skeleton Series 1. I love the color palette, I love the new pattern uh, right over here. Those are different keys that will open each compartment and then this is what we find when we open it. This is the background that is just so sweet and in here um, is Laguna Blue um, just when she's still like attached and then right over here we can see a graphic um, that is actually a vanity area that is so cool because there is like incorporation um, of many elements that we can find both in the animated series as well as the doll line and I think it's very very detailed um, I just love it so having explored um, this now we can move on to the specifics of the doll all right, so here we have our girl, and she's just so beautiful, really. Um, the only thing is that I wish uh, she came with uh, Saran Ha as opposed to Polly, but other than that, I think that she might be my favorite so far. I love the way she looks. I love the uh, lip gloss that this time is purple with this sort of like shimmer to it, and the makeup is really beautiful. On this Laguna as well so she comes with this headpiece that it's uh, giving me like um, yeah um, sea queen I would say and then these are the pair of earrings that I think they are supposed to resemble little like jellyfish and then there is this little necklace with the with an octopus uh, accent to it and it's transparent and then the octopus is painted in a curly co color and then as the rest of the girls from this collection she's got this crop top with um, long sleeves um, with uh, an off the shoulder cut and I love the design on it the stall this time it's really cool as well with this sort of like art um, deco nouveau um, style that we can find with that and then this is the skirt she comes with the very same iridescent sort of like material and they actually have this consistency uh, for each one in this line and then I love these shoes <laughs> um, I would call them boots but they're like sandals uh, platform sandals as well and in my opinion they're just so much uh, nicer than the second pair but there are um, people who might prefer these ones I don't know these are very like um, classic um, I would say I don't know um, they're darker in style um, and these ones are just so very beautiful aesthetically in my opinion with the swirls and the scales and the draping effect and then the ombre effect of them with the openings for the leg veins I think they look superb I just really like it very much and then for the hair again it's um, poly it isn't like the worst but it's very stiff uh, although I very much like the combination of colors this time around it's just a pity that you know you can do uh, much about it because it's a very dry sort of like texture so I miss um, her saran hair but she's very beautiful and then for the rest of the accessories she comes with these sort of like pearl um, underwater 
um, back that also comes with the chain. I mean, it reminds me of like the prisoner sort of like um, solid balls that are attached to their feet. <laughs> um, but this time is an underwater um, accent. And there's a number of factors as well of coloring and it opens. And then this is just the cutest. It's this powder compact that has the shape of a shell. And then it comes with a little um, cotton application um, that she can hold. And there's a spider web there. And um, there you can see the mix of colors. It is on a sticker or is, or is it? I think it is a print. It is a print and it's a bit pixelated. Um, but it's super cool looking and I love that it's also like ombre effect in the signature colors that we, we can find for her. And then the fact that it has the little like cotton part. It's just so beautiful. I love the shirt as well with the two fish hooks, um, you know, forming or are they hooks or probably like just the bones? They could be both. Uh, although I think they might be bones um, of fish and um, I love the sort of like, yeah, color palette, which is very similar to the one that we can find on this one. It's very like galaxy themed in a way. And then her treat is this Sunday ice cream um, that is really nicely done. The bottom part, the top part with a little tail poking out. I just love it. Then we have these shorts which um, are not my favorite, but I can see the reference to her original shorts with the pants uh, or the fishnets attached underneath as her uh, G1 um, version. And then the last thing are these uh, boots that have a little like extra fin. Um, um, one of the sides and then they're like gummy um, translucent blue with the soles in uh, black and then at the back we can find like these open mouths like piranhas um, you know t yeah like very scary looking <laughs> um, teeth um, so that is pretty cool but again like these ones are like by far my favorite I just love them so much and these are all the elements that we can find on this Ultimate Secret series 2 Laguna Blue. I love that two pieces and I hope that you've enjoyed this review and if you have well don't forget to like the video let me know what you think about it in the comments down below as always I will be more than happy to get back to all of you for now stay safe and I'll see you all very very soon bye bye